Hadith number 66. Salim says, After Hussein ibn Ali salam, was killed, ibn Abbas cried very much and then said, What did this Ummah see after the passing away of its Prophet? O oh Allah, I make you witness that I am a friend of Ali ibn Abi Talib and his children, and I am away from his and his children's enemies, and I have bowed my head in front of their commands. I reached Ali salam, in Zikr, a place. He took out a book and said to me, O oh, Ibn Abbas, this is that book that the Holy Prophet wasallam made me write, and I have written with my hands. So I said, O oh, Amir al-Mu'mineen, read it for me. So he read it. It had everything present in it that happened from the time of the passing away of the Holy Prophet ﷺ until the martyrdom of Hussein ﷺ and how and who will kill him and who will help him and who will be martyred with him. Then he cried very loudly and made me cry too. From what he read to me, there was also mentioned what will be done to him and how Fatima will be martyred how his son Hassan will be martyred, and how the Ummah will deceive him. So when he read how Hussein will be killed, and who will kill him, he cried very much. Then he wrapped up the book, and what will happen until the Day of Judgment remained unread. From what he read, there were the matters of Abu Bakr, Umar, and Usman, and for how many days each will remain as ruler, how the allegiance of Ali al-Islam was paid, the incident of Jamal and the going of Aisha, Dalha and Zubair and Safin and who will be killed in it, and Nehrawan's incident and the matter of Hakamein, governors, Muawiyah's rule and the Shias who will be killed during it, and what people will do to Hassan, and the matter of Yazid ibn Muawiyah, until it ended on the killing of Hussein. So I heard all this, then after all that he had read happened, it was neither less nor more. So I looked at his writing, which I recognized. It neither had changed, nor was its color changed. When he closed the book, I said, O oh, Amir al-Mu'mineen, only if you read the remaining part of the book for me. Alayhi salam said, No, but I will tell you. What is preventing me is what we will face from your family and children. They are very painful matters, that they will kill us, and bear enmity towards us. Their rule will be bad, and their strength will be very unfortunate. So I do not like that you hear it, and you become sad and depressed, but I will tell you. The Holy Prophet ﷺ held my hand at the time he was passing away. So one thousand keys of knowledge opened for me, and from every key one thousand doors opened. Abu Bakr and Umar were looking at me, and he was indicating to me, when I came out, both of them asked me, What did he tell you? So I told them both what I had been told. They both moved their hands and copied what I said. Then they both went away repeating what I had said, and both were shaking their hands. O oh, Ibn Abbas, Hassan will come to you from Kufa with one thousand, less one man. O oh, Ibn Abbas, when Bani Umayyah's rule ends, the first one from Bani Hashim, whose rule it will be, will be from your children. They will do a lot of things. Ibn Abbas said, I would have very much liked to write this book, instead of everything on which the rays of the sun have fallen.